Joanne with Broadcast Sunny. We are going to take a peek at Penny Hoffa's studio inside her home. Penny is with the Western Loudoun Artist Studio Tour. Stay tuned. So, while visiting um, artist Penny Hoffa, um, I was able to take a look at her home, get a tour of her home, which I love doing, and an artist's home is even better. Um, I, as we were touring her home, I filmed it and we had a co the casual conversation. Um, I tried to edit it so you can follow it along <laughs> as best as possible. Um, enjoy! Studio, Mitt Dog. <laughs> Cookie is my faithful companion uh, and gives me many great ideas, though all of them uh, involve stripes. Strangely, uh, and so it's a this a place where I work is a small space as opposed to my teaching room, which is a little bigger. Uh, my computer uh, cleverly redesigned standing workstation uh, with the idea that somehow that's healthier for me. Where is my treadmill? And <laughs> and on this side of my studio, uh, my painting station, uh, and and some of my artworks. Although I think. Perhaps I'm like other artists in that uh, I don't, I don't like to have exclusively my artwork around uh, because I've seen it already. <laughs> so a lot of the art in here is is not mine actually on on this wall. It's uh, mostly things I've. Uh, oh, I've got one of Jay Douglas's uh, paintings. He's a a friend and artist. Uh, I believe he's on the tour this year. Uh, oh, the fox, okay, is mine, I, I, I confess. Uh, and the eggplants with the charming googly eyes are my mother's. A uh, gicle of one of my mother's paintings. A uh, gicle because my sister also wanted it, so rather than cut it down the middle, <laughs> we made copies. Uh, oh, and, and, the, and, the, and some of the other things in here are by my students, so... Uh, and of course, yard sales, the perpetual source of all great artwork at $5 or less. So what are the challenges that you um, had to meet with your uh, studio when creating it? So I knew that I wanted to have north light. I know artists go on and on about north light, but uh, the main reason being that rather than direct light falling on your artwork, it's better to have a diffused light that casts an even lighting. Of course, I'm saying that <laughs> standing under a bank of fluorescent light, but it's allegedly daylight fluorescent, so that creates an even coverage of light onto my canvas and my palette. Um, the, another reason that I like this sort of size of room is that the more space you have, the more space you fill. <laughs> so this seemed like a good enough size to get everything done. It just means that everything's stacked in corners and I realize how stacked it is when a mouse gets in here and I have to find him and get him out. Uh, another reason is that sometimes I, yeah, she's taking an interest. I can see you really love this, don't you, Cookie? Yes, Mommy's doing an interview. Oh, splendid. Well, at least her eyes are open. That's fresh. Um, <laughs> and another reason that I've got the, the heavy drapes on the window is so that if I need to use a projector to project um, particularly text. I, I'm not very good at freehand text or calligraphy, so often I use a projector, so I shut everything in here so it's completely dark, and I can use the projector too. Um, was that a trade secret? Anyway. <laughs> well, I've always wanted to, I'm, I'm basically an eight-year-old. I mean, obviously not on the outside anymore, that's too bad, but, uh, but <laughs> I always wanted to live in a tree. Uh, Phil and I still talk about building a treehouse, and maybe we will. It's a treehouse or a castle, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. But in the meantime, we have this lovely home which we um, continuously decorate and cram full of art. A faux effect sort of thing from Athens. And the mantle is uh, some crazy artwork that we put together, uh, including the gold mice, of course, that goes with Lions and elephants, doesn't it? Anyway, yeah, so we each yeah, made a mouse. Um, we made we, are, they? we yeah, exactly. Uh, so yeah, so we've decorated with with gold mice. Which, it's a fun room. All your rooms are fun. <laughs> oh yeah, wait, there's more. 
<laughs> Wait, there's more. <laughs> this is a. This is a uh, fish tank, of course, because every stairwell needs one. <gasps> oh my God, that is, is it, so cool! Is it I'm crazy? Focusing on this. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, the, it's a fish tank. Yeah. And also, you know, you meet other people who are doing amazing things with different media, and you're thinking, oh, I want to get myself some of that. Uh, I think it helps with the creative mind. Yeah. So as we entered the basement, my battery on the camera died. That uh, should teach me to bring an extra battery. If you would like to see more of the interview with Penny Hoffa, uh, more formal interview with Penny Hoffa, please check her out. Um, if you would like to see more interviews with artists on the Western Loudoun Artist Studio Tour. Please check that out. And if you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.